Hello, and welcome once again to Davardi Glass Videos. Today we'll be discussing how to get started using Davardi Glass Rods. A couple of things you need to know about Davardi Glass. First of all, this is a lower heat glass than you may be used to. So you may need to do some readjusting in how you think and work. And secondly, most of the Davardi colors are extremely saturated. This means that there's a lot of color pigment added to the glass. This concentrated pigment can cause some colors to be a bit shocking. So, slow warming of the rods are essential. We suggest that beginners start out using a very low flame. You can see the torch flame is only just a few inches. And slowly wave your glass rod in and out of the flame until you can see it begins to change color at the tip. If you add the rod too quickly to the flame, it could splinter and shock. This color we're using here is the Davardi Opaque Salmon, perhaps the most shocking of all the colors. And you can see with the slow heating of the rod, there's no shocky problem at all. Now, for some of you people who don't use the oxygen propane setup and like to use a propane only torch head, such as the hothead or mag torch, here we're demonstrating the hothead using a semi opaque pink by Davardi. Notice we have the glass rod way in the tip of the torch flame. And as the rod slowly begins to heat, it'll change color slightly. And you slowly move that rod closer and closer toward the torch head. You can see now the glass rod is beginning to change color. And we're bringing it closer and closer, getting it hotter and hotter. Be sure to start way out in the tip and wave your glass rod in and out number of times until you notice that glass rod changing color a little bit from the heat and then slowly move that rod deeper into the flame where it's much hotter. Now one more thing that we do suggest is this glass rod warmer that we have available at very reasonable prices on our website. This will make your life so much easier. As you can see, you can take the glass rod directly from the warmer and put it right in the flame with no further heating required. Now this is uh, semi-opaque mango by Davardi and we're going to heat this up from room temperature just to show you once again how to slowly wave your rod in and out of the flame until you begin to see it change color from the heat and then slowly add that rod to the flame until it begins to melt.
Now, one more thing that I'd like to mention is that once you get used to how much heat it takes to slowly warm these rods, you can increase your flame size. I use a flame probably seven or eight inches or more sometimes. This glass can take more heat. It just requires that you slowly warm it in the beginning and slowly heat it. Be careful not to use excessive heat because you can ruin the glass, just like any glass. Now, this is a new glass that uh, the factory is making. It is a uh, rose with a gold aventurine inside the glass to make it sparkle. And this is a rod holder that we have available on our website. Great for short pieces of glass rod. Wait till you see this glass. This glass is just absolutely fabulous. The gold aventurine will just sparkle in the light. And of course the rose is just a fabulous color. Well, that's about it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it, learned a few things. Send us an email if you have any questions. Bye now from the both of us. Thanks again.